for E2 to connect to nice and contact, the API connection must be established. To do that, we need three pieces of information, the business unit, an access key, and a secret. Um, in user hub, we can get the business unit for, to, by going to ACD and then coming down to business units and getting that number right here. So the first thing we're going to do is then save it to a notepad. And the second thing we're going to do is create a access key. So if you select your name at the top and then the down arrow, you can get to access keys under my profile. Now, sometimes there is a problem and you can do it this way. Um, but the problem is you might not be able to see them. So like now I just created one, but I can't see it. So in that case, I would go over to admin and I would find my employee. So again, this would be me and I can go into the contact uh, access keys in tab there. Um, that was the access key I had just created. But again, this would be similar to the way uh, just under your your name in my profile. Either way, it creates the same thing. So you generate a new access key um, and we're gonna take a copy of that and we're gonna save it. Now the, the secret is only shown once. So if you do not get the secret and save it, you can never come back and and re um, access it. So when you get in this um, and copy it, make sure to copy it to your notepad again. And we're going to use those um, in the portal to set up the API connection uh, from the E2 to nice and contact.